Here's a question from my Yo! Is This Ageist blog. In a group Zoom, a friend referred to a 1960s TV show and said, this will date me. Yo, is this ageist? I later privately told her I thought saying that implied that being over a certain age is something to hide, even something to be ashamed of. She replied that she was being humorous, a common response to accusations of sexism or racism or ageism. I responded, check, check, and check. The comment is ageist for precisely the reasons she supplied, and calling it humorous is indeed a classic way to deflect feelings of discomfort or being criticized. It is fine to reference age. The problem arises when the reference reinforces a negative idea, in this case that being older is something to be embarrassed about or ashamed of. And that's exactly what this dates me suggests, as opposed to, I remember when that show came out, or I used to love that show. This question happened to come in from someone I know, and when I thanked her, she supplied a little backstory. The person in question actually leads a meditation group that she's in, and one of the group guidelines encourages people to acknowledge it if they are made aware that they've said something hurtful, because it often comes from a place of implicit bias around age or race or sex. And my friend wrote, I like this woman a lot, and she seems sensitive, so I was surprised at her defensive reaction. I was being humorous. I'm sure I've used it myself and believed it, too. We all have. Most bias is unconscious. Confronting it is uncomfortable. So I commend my friend on acknowledging her own defensiveness and on calling it out on the part of a woman she admires. That's how we change the culture.